for over 12 years now. We've been, I've been coming here and making music, and there's nothing better than coming to the school. <laughs> it's so nice. It's so nice. I had never worked in a, a you know alternative learning <laughs> environment or special needs environment. I need some drummers. Celebrate the Children is a school for children with challenges with relating and communicating. Uh, we have children here from ages three all the way up through 21. The Love Me For Who I Am project um, was an idea that um, I had after after one really great performance a couple years back here at the school. It was a, just a, a, a joyful, uh, crazy concert that, that we had. <laughs> But after, after this show, I said to Dan, who is the uh, music teacher here, I said, we have to write these guys some songs. <laughs> I think that our kids respond to many types of, of music, but I think that Brady is very special because he has taken the time to understand our children. He just kind of exudes that, whether he's on stage singing or even the time that he takes off stage before a concert or after a concert. One of the goals of Love Me For Who I Am was to give these kids and this community some anthems. They raise their fist in the air and uh, say, you know, I'm a picky eater, you know? I don't want to wear shoes. I don't like change, man, you know? Come on, look, look at things through my eyes. Please don't try to fix me. Love me for who I am. Please don't try to fix me. Love me for who I am. Well, yeah, he said, uh, well, I like the, the Love Me For Who I Am track. And I said, why do you like it? And I said, well, do you like the music or do you like to dance to it? And he said, I like the please don't try to fix me part. He said, it's kind of like saying it's good to be a misfit and that it's OK, right? You said that there's it's for toys on the island of misfit. Yeah, he kind of equated it to the island of misfit toys. Well, the thing that made them different made them happy. But that's but sad at first. Please don't try to fix me. Love me for who I am. Cause I am. We definitely wanted the songs to uh, be anthemic in that way. Some of the titles also were um, were inspired by some of the students, some of the things that they've said, uh, you know, don't fix me, love me for who I am. And then with every CD that I put out, they, they play the CDs in the classrooms. So when they come into the auditorium for the concert, they're, they're ready to roll, they're ready to rock, and, and, and they're, you know, they're shouting out requests, they're coming up on stage, they're playing air guitar, they're singing in the microphone, they're singing the background parts. Um, it's, um, it's some of the most inclusive and interactive um, performances and shows that, that I've ever done. Something that I saw, especially at the concerts, was, you know what? We're going to let the, the child be themselves and, and explore this music and explore this relationship, you know, even saying hi to me or, or me coming to the classroom, as they, they would do it themselves. Love Me For Who I Am project has just been uh, received so well um, with the school, with the, with the community, with the kids especially, and so much so it just gets you excited for uh, <laughs> Love Me For Who I Am Volume 2. Feels so right to be naked and free I just like Mother Nature She wanted me to 